Okay, so most times on Texas Outdoors, I go out and I do something that's a lot of fun. And I did again this week, but this time I took a couple of friends along with me on a fishing trip. What are we going to do well, today? Well, today, again, we're going to go off the redfish here at Lake Bronick. It's a prime, prime time, prime season right now. It's springtime. So let's go, guys. Let's All get right. it on. Fired up. Let's go. When I called Manny Martinez and told him the morning crew wanted to go on a fishing trip, he jumped at the chance. And when Paul saw Manny had radar, well, of course, he had to find out all about it. You're not looking at the whole 26 feet, 100 yards yeah. that way. Yes, yes. What kind of radar, what kind of radar you got over here? It's nothing like yours on Kings oh, 5, my friend. That, this is cool. for real here. That's pretty cool, though. Yeah, this technology. <laughs> okay, well, I'll tell you what, since we're in your boat, we'll go with that. <laughs> <laughs> That radar lit up with fish all afternoon, and it didn't take long to find fish. Uh oh, there you go, there you go. There you go, come on. Here you go, we got one right here. And now you're gonna start reeling. Hold on one second. I'm gonna tighten it up a little, okay, go. Ladies before gentlemen, so Audrey struck first. Got it. Landing a nice striper, striper and the first jab. Paul, that is mine. Are you gonna be able to do the same is the question. But it didn't take long for Paul to answer either. Keep pressure on him. It's pretty good size. However, it wasn't necessarily the answer Paul wanted to give. Oh, I did lose it. Oh, do you need me to teach you I how did, it's yes, done? I do, right, Audrey. Audrey, Audrey what, what was Paul's problem there? Yeah, what uh, tell him, Audrey. I really <laughs> felt like he got a little too excited and he let the reel go and the fish just got away. Sometimes <laughs> I have a tendency to get real excited. Yeah. Don't I? Yes. You just gotta. Go with the flow, Paul. Settle down, settle down. Experience fishermen like me and myself. <laughs> Apparently, there's some truth in humor. After Audrey landed a nice 10 pound red, Paul got a few tips from the expert. As you go down, you reel. Okay. And if he run, if he takes ah, drag, yeah. Yeah, there you go. Let him yeah. run. Yeah, because if you're constant. If you're constant, you're, you're gonna get wheel, nowhere. Get right. right. But there, okay? When down you go down, and, and reel. She got it. She got the big fish. You know, Audrey, she's really good. She's good. He took the advice to heart. Paul was not to be denied. This red put up a good fight, but in the end, he went in the cooler right alongside Audrey's, as well as a few other nice fish. It's beautiful. And at the end of the day, we all went home with enough for a meal or two. I want to thank my friend Manny Martinez, fishingwithmanny.com. He really put us on some great fish, and we had a blast all afternoon. Just like Audrey and Paul, though, I'd like to take you along on one of our adventures. So if you have an idea for something for us to do outdoors, you can email me, bdavis at kins5.com, or hit me up on the Kins 5 Facebook page. Come on an adventure with us into the great Texas outdoors. and. Paul, you you did a fine job. You you didn't lose one really big fish. We didn't get to see it, but but I, we did well, didn't I, we? I actually lost a couple, and one of them was really big. But yeah, reeled in a couple, and so we had a lot of fun. I feel like out of this, there's an idea born here at fishing with judges, a fishing show, and Audrey gets to judge Paul. Oh, and well, well, there's a reason why Audrey talks for a living. <laughs> <laughs>